Hi, this is Stacy with another installment of PubMed search videos. And this time we are going to be uh, looking more at mesh. Uh, last time in our last video, we were looking at uh, searching for articles up here in the top box and then using the tools on the right hand side to find our subject headings. This time we are going to be using the mesh database to find our medical subject headings and then run our search from there. So I'm going to click on Mesh Database under the Explore menu, which will take us to this screen. Our search box is up at the top, and I'm going to uh, stay with our earlier search for ADHD. So I'll put in ADHD. I'm going to run this search. And we have here uh, the medical subject heading for ADHD, which is Attention Deficit Disorder with Hyperactivity. Uh, we have a scope note here that uh, comes from the DSM-5, and we can see that this term was introduced in 1984. In our last video, we were looking at uh, having the subject heading restricted to a major MeSH topic so that the article would be uh, the major topic, the primary topic um, for ADHD. We can duplicate that uh, effect by uh, clicking on Restrict to Major Mesh Topic down here at the bottom. So I've got that checked off. The heading that is on the screen, you can use the tools that are over here on the right to build a search with. So I'm going to click Add to Search Builder. And you can see now that we have this heading, Attention Deficit Disorder with Hyperactivity. And they've put that in quotes for us. And then we have the major mesh topic uh, chosen down here. So it's put in the MAJR in square brackets for us. Now, last time we were looking at uh, diet therapy, and we could uh, get the same kind of search by checking off diet therapy and then uh, building our search that way. But instead, I would like to look specifically at sugars for this. So I'm going to look for sugar in the MeSH database. And here at the top we have sugars. And uh, what a nice thing to do with the MeSH database is, is pick a broad uh, term within your search and then come down here and look at what is uh, called the MeSH tree to see how this all separates out. So under sugars, we have dietary sugars. We also have dietary sucrose and high fructose corn syrup. So if we want something uh, tighter than sugars, more restrictive than sugars, but maybe we don't want to go just to sucrose, we can look at dietary sugars. Now we see the dietary sugars uh, heading here at the top of the screen. We can see that it was introduced in 2018. So this one hasn't been around for a long time, uh, but we do have uh, several years worth uh, to work with on this term. We can click Add to Search Builder, and now we see we've got our Attention Deficit Disorder Major Heading and Dietary Sugars Mesh. And this is the search that we've built. We can click Search PubMed, and we get eight results for this. If we're interested to see what would happen uh, if instead we used the uh, heading for um, dietary carbohydrates instead, we can come back here and add our uh, ADHD major heading. And then we can run our search for sugars again sugars. And if instead of uh, looking at dietary sugars, this time we look at dietary carbohydrates. There's dietary carbohydrates. Add to search builder. We can search PubMed again. And this time we have 32 results. So moving up and down on the mesh tree here can change things for you quite a bit. Um, we could also instead look at uh, high fructose corn syrup, if you're just curious about that. Though this one uh, has only been around since 2015. We can add that to the search builder. go back and get uh, ADHD, restrict that to major, add to the search builder, search PubMed, 
and we get zero results for this one. So this one is too specific. We would be better off looking at either the uh, dietary sugars or the dietary carbohydrates. So moving up and down the tree here uh, will really uh, make some differences in your search. So experiment with this, try it out, uh, build some searches and uh, just play with it and see what you can find.